What is going on guys, DBG here, and this is another episode of the 2K for free series. So, on uh, we have got a few players since our last episode of the series. And obviously, if you guys have looked at my last video, or any other videos, we've been playing a lot. And I mean a lot of TT Offline. We're right now 512 wins. We played an extra 60 games. Well, basically, was it Sunday? We have 420. Today's Wednesday. Like by the end of today, I'll probably be on like 540s. We played about 30 games a day. And Monday. Actually, no, when Byron Beck came out. When Byron Beck came out, we um we were on 420s. We've played nearly like a hundred games since Byron Beck has come out. And yeah, we have not seen Byron Beck, which is a little bit annoying if I'm not pretty sure I'm right with that. But uh yeah, so new players that we did get. You guys are watching my No Money Spent series episode. We managed to get Victor Oladipo. And also, we evoed up Wally Zerbiak. So this guy is going to be the... He's going to be that main man. He's going to be that main option. Like, as you guys can see, I've 20.9. Basically, I scored 21 points a game with him because I've been just trying to evo him up. He... Uh, well, he's shooting not a great percentage from three, I don't think, because I'm just ju chucking up bad shots, but all them have been offline, basically, so it doesn't really matter. The guy's got half catch and shoot, half pick dodger, half clamps. The guy's got half clamps and half range. There are four wings in the game with that badge. It is um, Kawhi Leonard, Havlicek, T-Mac. So Kawhi's level 40 award. Havlicek's 2 million lock in, T-Mac's 500k. And Wally Zerbiak is Wally Zerbiak. He's also got half flexible for current gen. He's got half unpluckable. He's got 34 gold badges. Like, the only weakness in this card is the dude can't dunk. Straight up, the only weakness. Say not dunk, he can't dribble. He's actually got a moderately good dunk. His dribbling is very much average. Or say he's very bad. I'll be the first to say that. So, he's not going to be, like, the main creator. But And his block rating's not great. But other than that, like, he's going to be a perfect player to have in the wing. The real question is, is like... When are we going to get... A, actually, no, sorry. We do have a better point guard. So let's say when are we going to get a p better point guard because of... That was a limited week. So where is... Who do we want to use a point guard? So we've got... We got Ja. And then we got Iverson. And I don't care what Ty says. Iverson's good on this gen. Iverson's good. I don't care. Iverson's coming in. The main thing is we've got Jack Marin off the bench now. And we have a, we're developing a little bit of a squad, aren't we? So... Yeah, basically, it's now between Wesley Matthews and Victor Oladipo for this spot. So, they're about the same height. In terms of badges, you got four halves on Oladipo. We, um, highlight film doesn't really matter. Pick Dodger, it's all right to have. In terms of goal, they both have goal clamps. They both, or you've got goal range and you don't have range at all on Oladipo. I mean, you've only, sorry, you've only got bronze range. I don't know why I thought he had gold range. So you've you got bronze range on him. And you got better dribbling on Oladipo. So Oladipo has got a minus 33 ball. Way better dunk. He is a little bit, but not that much faster. That or quickness a little bit better for Oladipo. Honestly, these guys are similar. And for the sake of keeping the squad overall down, I guess I'm going to use Wesley Matthews. Um, but they are very, very similar. But anyway, Wally Zerbiak is obviously going to be the standout player in the squad. Wally Zerbiak, Brad Davis, and Antoine Jameson. So basically, these are the three main guys, and we got Jack Marin kind of carrying off the bench. So, two other guys we want. Like, as much as I like Batum, I do want to replace Nick Batum. Um, and I also want to replace... Basically, I want a point guard, a two guard for uh, Wes Matthews, and then power forward. That's kind of who we want to get next. So, we got 10 days or 9 days left. So, we're going to be still chipping away at Terry for, with these 9 days. So, like, we need to play... Is it, like, 25 games? If I play... I'm trying to think. I need 250... Or I need, like, 240 games with 9 days. So, like, if I play 30 games a day... Yeah. I, I don't even... If I play 30 games a day, I'll have Doug West. And then that's my two-guard position pretty much sorted. And Michael Finley, you just never know. And you just never know. At this point, I'm bound to get... Surely I'm going to get Byron back. So we're not going to run with this lineup here because obviously two of these guys are not free. So let's go out with... Gold. Just any players. Just going to go with Gold. And who's free? Luka Doncic. And... 
Silver Rick Fox. There we go. This works. Pretty sure uh, so these are the two lowest rated cards you can put in. And we're just gonna go and do what we've been doing for like the last few days. And it's just been baiting or shooting threes with um, while he's over here. Actually, he's got half range now. I don't need to fade anymore. I can literally just run to like here. Oh my god, he got a 40 on that, really? I'm just saying, the uh, the AI is a million times better um, in TTO right now, in TD offline than they used to be. Like, I'm convinced they bumped up the difficulty. I don't care, shoot that, it's Amethyst Del Curry. Actually, why was I saying shoot that, it's Amethyst Del Curry? It's Amethyst Del Curry. Like, normally I used to be able to just do this and run to this spot right here with Curry and literally be wide open every single time. But to be fair though, if it works, if it works, it works. If I can get open again there, I'll be happy. But like, yeah, that's the, that's the half deep threes Wally Zerbiak chipping in there. Like all of him deep threes is so OP on this gen. He just hit that. All right, I'm just gonna have to hard off ball on somebody else then. Hey guys, can you guys get out of the way? Just need to get into a little space. Like, look at the pressure. Look at the pressure that the, the AI puts on. There must have been a difficulty spike somewhere. He's like, I was using Steph Curry for literally days, and anytime I did this move here, or anytime I did that weird hezzy that I did um, when Del Curry helped up, it ended up being like a non-contest. However, one thing maybe, maybe uh, Del Curry has realized that Wally Zerbiak has replaced his son in my TTO lineup. So he's uh, doing his best to try to get Steph Curry to spot back. So I can't lie. Like, anytime I did this, I would get open with Steph. This animation here into this spot right here. I'd be it would be a wide open every time. Like, not a 37% contested shot. Wide open every time. Maybe it's just something to do with just the way Steph dribbles the burst. I don't know, but... I didn't get much to actually shoot it. Just don't let, Del let anyone but Del Curry shoot it. I can go with anyone on this guy's team, but Del or not this guy. I'm going with anyone on the AI team shooting the ball except Del Curry. And we have left Del Curry wide open. Great smart defense there by me. And we can't get a board with. Who's that? Marcus Smart. Alright, let's just fade. Let's just oh we blew it. <laughs> we blew it. Oh, it's nowhere. It's not as easy. It's not as easy playing this mode without Steph Curry. I'll be the first to say that. Like. Playing this mo this becomes easy mode once you get Steph Curry into the squad. Oh my God! Can we just hit a shot? Can we just hit a shot? That would be nice. That would be nice. Surely they're not got pressure up on that. They're pressure up on it. That's a shot. There we go. Good shot there by Wally. All right, so we've got should have taken out, shouldn't he? Yeah. Good old L3 press. If you guys say or three press, if you guys don't know, you can trigger takeover already on next gem or press or three. And we've let Marcus Smart get another rebound. Smart by me. Really smart by me. Please don't make please don't put pressure behind the halfway line on me. There we go. Good shot. Okay, two more. Two more, and we got this. We got this finished. Alright, let's wait back. Let's wait back. Make him shoot the ball with a Reese, I guess. Why? My players literally switched. They switched matchups and I don't know why. I was like, why is Del Curry being guarded by the dude I'm off balling on? We blew it. Bank, let's go. Big bank right there. All right, come on. Come on. Just do, just keep the off ball on Del Curry. I don't care. Literally, I'm paint sitting on Trevor Reza and Del Curry goes 620. Okay, you're good. You're good. Oh, that's his range. There we go. That's green. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. At this stage, like, at this stage, I'll be annoyed. I'll be annoyed if I get back. But I don't know if I'd rather back or a thousand empty. Like, back at least works for this series. But like, man, I still, I still don't know. I still. It's weird and it's like, I kind of want back for this series, but at the same time, I don't want to get back because it's just going to be heartbreaking. Like it's going to be, if we get Byron back here, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, B, A, start. Come on, if we get back here, it's going to be heartbreaking. But if we get the dentist though, whew, you better believe we're having a party. 
You better believe we get the dentist. We're having a party here. It's thousand empty. It's a freaking thousand empty again. Oh, my account. My, my IP's glitched. My IP, it's, I've done it in three accounts. Like, I've literally played my games on between three different accounts. People are talking about, oh, 2K just don't like your account. No, no, I've played it on three different accounts. Including one of them that I can guarantee you 2K doesn't know I have. Because it's a PC account that I've been playing on a VPN. And I still can't get the card. Oh, man. All right. All right, we're good. Let's see who we face on Limited. We haven't lost with this team yet, so it'll be interesting. We buy in someone good, then it might be quite a tough one, but we have still not lo yet lost with this team. Okay, let's see. Let's see what this guy's team is. Okay, he's got <sighs> this bum. This absolute bum. I don't care. I'm not going for the reward anyway. You absolute bum. What's his team name? My stick chose you. Dude, what are you doing with white home kits? What are you doing? You are literally just ruining the game for everybody you play against. That's a quit right there. We just lost a thousand empty on contracts, but it was worth it. It was worth it. I'm not playing a game with two white jerseys. Actually, actually, I know what I'm doing. I should have done this. That's my fault. It's my fault. Dude, I have custom kits, don't I? Yeah. Keep changing the exit. Why can't I use my custom kits? No money spent. There we go. There we go. Just make sure I have those on all of my accounts. Make sure on all of mine I have these kits. Because if we were running with these jerseys, if we were running with these jerseys, it would not have mattered. We would, we would have been fine. These jerseys are there for a reason. Like, if you guys don't know, I have these jerseys for a reason. And that was that exact reason. People running matching kits. And I'm colorblind, so kits may be similar. But not matching, but for me, they'll look like they're matching. So that's a loss right there. Not a big deal. Um, again, I'm not going for Mikhail. I'm just playing this game for... I, got, I think of these like 14 or these 19 games. Again, I think like three have been losses. So like 13 and three is not a bad unlimited run. The three losses were against good players. And I don't know, I'm just kind of casually playing this game right now. Like I'll sweat when I want to sweat. I'll play casually when I want to play casually. And... Right now, I'm just playing casually. Don't be the same dude again. Please don't be the same dude again. Oh, he's gone straight to the settings. Oh. Not what we want to see. I actually don't use settings. I'm actually starting to just not use settings. Uh, at this stage, it's just like playing this game. Like, they make so little of a difference on next gen. I actually don't. Just don't use them enough. Oh, it's like... It's just the most... For me, it makes almost no difference. Like, he's going... Like, how many settings is this guy going to? Like, is he changing matchups and everything? He's going through every little thing. He's going to freak... I know what he's going to do to me. He's going to be running plays. And that's fine. That is fine, man. Just come on, Dr. Mara. You've spent a minute in the game... Coaching game plan. Like, it's not that deep. It's not gonna make it's not gonna make or break you. If you're spending more than 15 seconds on settings, then you're probably not a not a player. Like, all right, so he's got pink diamond. Yeah, and he's got Aaron Gordon. With by the looks of it, diamond shoes probably most of his players. Okay, we're good. Um, run for lance. He's got Iverson, really. You'd spend all that time on your settings and you're running Iverson? You should have late. It's like the first time we've ever shot a light with him. It's fine. That's fine. Shoot the three ball if you want. Run him off, run him off. I have to go up to two. That's fine. It's fine. Okay. Dot corner. That's your green. Off a half dime or pass. It's green every time. Come on. Come on. You can't... Uh, 
Can't expect anything different there. It's fine. I'm just going to paint it. Prove to me you can do something with Yanis. Prove to me you can do something with Yanis. I'm going to switch. And I've just put you... Like, I've just got a better matchup now. Okay, nice dunk. Nice dunk. You proved to me you can hold or two. Yeah, that's not going to win you this game, trust me. You're going to need to do more than hold or two to win this game. Dunk that. Oh, that's a bad, bad possession right there. It's fine. He's posting me up. What? Shoot it. Shoot the ball. He can hit that shot. Shoot the ball. Dude, shoot the ball. Good shot. That's not... That's actually, shooting a fade may not have been the smartest idea in the world, but... Dude, you gotta prove to me you can shoot the ball with Giannis. Okay, everyone get out of my way. He's getting drop stepped. Get out of my way, Sabonis. Good, de good offense. Good defense by him. Post hook. Easy layup. Let's go. And we're so, you know what, That's we've actually put our match, we've got, we've kind of sorted our matchups here already. Um, I know what he's doing. I can live with that, because he's, he's quick horns for flyer. Like, you can see the way his team is set up, that he's waiting for, to come up for a pick and pop with Yanis, and I don't care if he pops with Yanis. I really don't. Alright, Zerbiak, you come up. Sabonis, set him with a quick screen. Sabonis, you're going to be open. I just want to see, can he grab me in the post? That's a bad animation, we just got to put it up and hope for the best. Unlucky. I should have probably just reset there, honestly. But that's a great defensive possession there by Wes Matthews. Sh proving why you're in there over Oladipo. Actually, just attack corner should be open here, which it is. A little bit of a slow pass, but it doesn't matter. Chicken man is not going to end the three. Okay, let's drop back. He's not. He's not doing anything with Giannis at this stage. Get out of my way, Jameson. Jameson literally nearly caused a basket there. Oh, he's just running. I know what he's doing. He's popping. He's popping. He's popping. We're there. Oh, unlucky. I like these plays, though. He's missed a lot of... He has missed... Uh, I'm telling you right now, this guy has missed so many open players. But I like these sets. It's not like the normal Miami Heat playbook. It's actually some, like, plays that take a little more than three seconds to get the open shot. Later. Good shot. There we go. We take the lead. Let's see what this guy's gonna got coming out of a timeout. It's fine, he has to pass somewhere. He's going nowhere, he's going nowhere, dive. Great defense, big hand, big board. Let's go, Jameson. Chicken man playing defense right now. Someone's gonna be open. It is, dump into the big man, and they just, they got a really lucky rotation. I had nothing really too wrong with what I did there. It just happened that the game rotated. Well, nothing... I did I did something wrong there. Nothing he did well. The game just rotated him into the perfect position. That's the slowest pass ever. That's literally just a player deciding that they didn't want to be a basketball player and throwing the softest pass in history. Good defense, Iverson. That's Iverson clamping up Giannis right there. Who says Iverson's terrible? Who says Iverson's a bum? Dot corner. That's, the, that's, again, the pass is just so slow. You're throwing a ball like you're 11 years old. Okay. Is he going to overcommit? Nope. I mean, I have to fade, don't I? I don't have anything else. Good shot. I kind of need a foul. Because I need to get my bench in. My starters are too tired. And stamina means too much in this game. So I really need to foul. Okay, we're good. We're good. Let's calm it down. Let's calm it down. Your job is to protect the basket. If he shoots with Giannis, he shoots with Giannis. Always remember that. Like, he stick shot. It's smart. Really smart. He's very easy to agree with the stick. I should have went to Iverson. Iverson's still wide open. And that's a slightly late. He's going to hit with a delay catch animation. Great rebound there by Nick Batum. Good foul. All right, I know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do. I need, because I need a bit of a run here. I'm going to leave Jack Maron on the floor. I'm going to leave my best five on for about, until about three minutes ago in the quarter, and I'm going to end the game with my best five. So I'm going to go with Brad Davis. going to go at the 
three. Wally, you're in there. Marin, you're in there. Power four, Chicken Man. Center Sabonis. Gonna go out with my best five right here. And just see, just see what happens. It's fine, shoot it. It's a fade. No fading whites for him. Got him on the curry. Green that, please. Oh, we missed that! Good defense. Good steal. Let's go. Oh, that's his shot. That's his shot. That's his shot. Zerbiak there for three. Let's go. All right, we're now... We're now in some better shape right here. We're in the press now. Again, a little bit of just token. Why was he left wide open? Chicken man. Let's go. Let's go. That is well and truly chicken man territory. All right. Let's go. Attack. He's going to attack me. Like, again, green once with Giannis, and then maybe I'll respect Giannis. Simple as. Just green once with him. Like, I don't, like, if you green, if you show me that you have, you are physically capable of green with Giannis, I'm probably not going to leave Giannis wide open. It's so easy to green in this game. Chicken man just missed. It's my fault. See some serious problem right there if he's missing. Don't let him shoot the three. Do not let him shoot the three. I'll take him going to the basket. Oh, we, we could not have done more in defense there. That's fine. Like sometimes you play good defense and they just get the animations. That's what happened there. Like, I don't think he necessarily did anything wrong on offense, just like I didn't do anything wrong on defense. We're good. We are good. Okay, let's drop it back. Let's drop back. We're there. Oh, he just went, he went through me. It's fine. It's fine. In all these situations, it's honestly just stay calm. Stay calm, we win this game, win it comfortably. Got right by him. Jack Marin, tough layup. Dude blew the lay that layup. Good defense. Dude, who's, what, why? Why are you leaving the basket? Oh, I just don't get this game sometimes. Wide open. Please don't miss that. Should be open, which we are. Please give me that. 2K, you're screwing at me now. You're actually just screwing at me. And it's an arm one. Oh my god. Okay, so I put in a lineup to and the purpose of the lineup was basically to uh extend the lead, and all it's done is lost us the lead. Okay. This is actually a lot on Jack Marin here. This possession is going to be a lot on Jack Marin's shoulders. He's, we got a bait. We missed the bait. Great defense. That's actually really good defense so far. Great recovery. Great recovery and the AI bails him out. Literally nothing better we could have done. Nothing better we could have done. We rotated well. We recovered well. He made some bad decisions. We got to contest on that and the AI bailed him out by just hacking for no reason after a really good defense possession. So like we force him into a bad shot. Unfortunately, if the AI is gonna hack, then every shot's a good shot. It's basically guaranteed two points. Oh, big fade, big fade, big fade, let's go. Hey, bail me out 2K, bail me out. Spam. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's defense by Wally Zerbiak. Okay, you deserve, you deserve something from this. But Jack Marin's wide open in the corner. I mean, as much as Wally Zerbiak deserved it, something from that, like I think our team deserves to score more than Wally Zerbiak. So let's go. Five point lead here. We're there. Great defense. Better layup. That's fine. Giannis is gonna trigger some animations that'll Giannis is always gonna trigger some good animations. So we've actually pulled it out to three point lead with the ball. And that's fine. Like I think I should be able to hold that on for another like two and a bit minutes until we can call a timeout in the fourth and get our strongest five back in. Like, I think Iverson can kind of hold that down. Batum can hold it down. This dude's back into his pause settings, really. Really back into his pause settings. Okay, Batum, it's your job to get back because he's going to blow by me. Spam. Batum, you are so slow. You are so slow, Nick Batum. And then Giannis' take. All right, this is the ball game again. 
Here's the ball game again. Let's get chop. Okay, I gotta go one more offense, one more defense. Is he gonna leave Nick Batum, I reckon? No, he got the he switched, he switched, he switched, he switched. Make him help. Get everybody stop moving. Please, everybody stop moving. Stop moving. You've just let him switch. You've just let him make a good switch there. If you just stood and stopped moving, we were good. We were all good. We had it. We literally had that. And now he's right, he switched right back into the matchups he wants. We get a lucky pass there to Batum, which is the slowest pass ever. And Batum goes and misses the fade. Big board, big board, big board. Don't get swatted. Okay, yep. Yeah, we're good. Three minutes to go. Good call of a timeout. But like literally, we had the point guard on the big. We were just trying to get everybody to help. And they just ran into random positions. Who programs this? Who programs this? Like, there's just so many things wrong with this game's offensive AI. It's so bad. Oh, baited. Got a foul. Okay, we're all good. I know he's going to Giannis. Honestly, it's going to be a tough job stopping Giannis here. And it might be a two-man job. And we forced the miss. We forced the miss. You got the board. Great defense. Big board. Big board. Big board. Okay, chicken man. You have the ball in your hands. You're good. They've left the point guard wide open. Brad, your shot. Big white. Nope. That's a bad miss. That was almost good defense there. He's going to have to throw a pass, is he? Brad Davis, one of three. In each half. Brad Davis, two of six. That's not good enough. No, I got glitched out of bounds. I didn't press any buttons. Oh, my God. I, got, I literally didn't press any buttons. He flopped, and I glitched out of bounds. Oh, my God. Oh, that's, that's literally an animation that's happened to me twice this year. Is glitching out of bounds on a flop. Your player takes, a lot of the time takes like an extra step when someone flops. I glitched out of bounds during that animation. Wait, just give it to him. Off drop stepper. Please, everybody. This is exactly what I wanted last possession. And why did you not drop step? Oh my God. You've got half drop stepper. Can you please drop step? You are so lucky that they left chicken man. You are so lucky, Sabonis, that they decided that it was in their best interest to leave the best shooter in the game. He got me crabbed. And he hits white. All right. All right, that's fine. Brad, this is all you. This is all you. They're going to probably leave corner. Which they do. We dock corner. Big white needed. Can we just hit whites? Like, simple as, like... Simple as, we just needed a big white right there. Off a half dime or pass to a wide open shooter, like... If that's not if that's not a white that should go in, I don't know what is. That corner again. Fake. Okay, we're good. If he's, is he off ball? He's off ball. Okay, please set the screen the way I want it to be. Not there. And he's on ball that. Have to fade. Have to fade. Please let me hit the white. 2K, can you stop screwing me? Spam. Great defense. That is insane defense. Get the board, man. I mean, imagine how different this game could have been if we just successfully drop stepped Allen Iverson. Can we walk it back into an open? Yes, we can. Maybe. Of course, of all the ball could literally land anywhere it lands into their hands. Okay, this is a big defensive possession here. Should have gotten a steal there. We had the pinch. We had the pinch we wanted. Great block. All right. All right. That's fine. Go two for one. I don't know whose hands I want the ball in. Probably Brad Davis. But all I know is that Damantis Savonis, you, you may never play for me again on this gen. Because that was a pathetic... I actually put it in the lawyer's hands. So I know what I'm doing. Attack space. Attack space. Curry. Let me hit a white! Bait. Literally. Literally. Like milliseconds off. Nothing else we could have done there. Apart from obviously time better. I'm one. Let's go. 
That was a risk. That was a risk right there. Big free throw. Big green. Let's go. I actually am delighted he called a timeout because it means Giannis can't get out of steam. All right. I don't know what way I want to do my matchups. I'm just going to keep them as they are. I know he's going to Giannis. I know he's taking it too. He barely greened the entire game. If he greens a three-pointer with Giannis to win this game, then congratulations. He deserves a medal. See, quick coins for Flaren. I mean, I'm fine with whatever. That's not a... Oh, my God. That's the biggest bailout in history, 2K. I'm going to run with Marin. And I will call time with three seconds left if we don't have a wide open. Stolen, is it? Yeah, not none. It was worth it. It was worth it. There's no... There was no need right there. And we literally make one of the best... The best, like, blitzes in the game. And they bail him with a foul. Alright. I mean, it's got to be chicken, man. I mean, Chicken Man's got to be the one that's running around in a circle. Wide open. You up? Oh, my God. You can't ask for a better shot than that. You actually cannot ask for a better shot than that, like, in this game. I mean, should I have stopped, maybe? I had, I had a whole... I was, no one was anywhere near me. I cannot, like, you cannot ask for better shots than I had down the stretch. I missed time the few, and the game gave him some big whites. Like, and the game bailed him, basically. Like, you cannot, like, I don't think I could have, I had a five, six point lead. And I don't think I could have played much better and lost. Like, I just don't. I'm more confused than anything. Because I don't, like, obviously I hit a couple of whites, but... The sheer amount of lucky bounces he got. I legitimately do not think I could have played much better in that game. I don't think so. But, um... Yeah, Wally looked alright. Man, the Mantis of Onus sucked. Actually, maybe it's not his fault. The game just thinks Alan Iverson's the best post defender in the game. I Like, you can drop step... I can drop step Alan Iverson with Brad Davis. I couldn't drop step Alan Iverson with half drop step with Savonis for some reason. Some of the weirdest things ever happened in the last three minutes of that game. And I just... Oh, I just can't. I just can't. Sometimes... Sometimes 2K is broken. And by sometimes, I mean all the time. But, um, yeah, that's just an annoying... That is just an annoying thing that happens. At the end of the day, though, I still enjoy playing this game. It is awful. Like, it is beyond broken. But I have fun. So... You know what? 2K's been broken every year since 2K13. At least this one's fun. So anyway, that's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.